Hello boys and girls, today we're going to read the story of City Dog and Country Frog. It's written by Mo Williams and the pictures were done by John Booth and it's brought to you by permission of Hyperion Publishing and Niagara County Library, of course. Spring. City Dog didn't stop on the first day in the country. He ran as far and as fast as he could and all without a leash. Uh-oh, he must have got away from his mommy and his daddy. City Dog spotted something he'd never seen sitting on a rock. It was Country Frog. What are you doing, asked City Dog. Waiting for a friend, replied Country Frog with a smile. But you'll do. City Dog and Country Frog played together. City Dog was new to the country, so Country Frog taught him Country Frog games. Looks like they're hopping. Country Frog games involve jumping and splashing and croaking. I can't imagine a doggy doing that. That was spring. Summer. City Dog didn't stop to admire the green, green grass. He ran straight for Country Frog's rock. I'm going to do you a favor, said City Dog, when he found Country Frog. I'm going to teach you City Dog games. I think you're going to stick with him. City Dog games involved sniffing and fetching and barking. Doggy, doggy barking, I can understand, but a frog? Hmm. City Dog and Country Frog played until Country Frog was too tired to sniff and fetch and bark anymore. <laughs> that was summer. Fall. City Dog didn't stop to sniff the falling leaves. He ran straight for Country Frog's rock. I think he wants to see his friend. What should we play today, asked City Dog. Dog or frog games? Country Frog took a deep breath. Oh, I'm a tired frog, replied Country Frog. Maybe we can play remembering games. City Dog and Country Frog sat together on the rock. They remembered their spring jumping and splashing and croaking. They remembered their summer sniffing and fetching and barking. That was fall. Winter. City Dog didn't stop to eat the snow. He ran straight for Country Frog's Rock. City Dog looked for Country Frog. Where's his friend? Country Frog was not there. Look at him, he looks lonesome, looking around for his friend. Oh my goodness. It looks like the water's all frozen. That was winter. Spring again. Country Chipmunk spotted something that she had never seen sitting on a rock. It was Sippy Dog. What are you doing? asked Country Chipmunk. Well, I'm waiting for a friend, replied City Dog sadly. Looks like this frog friend isn't there. And then he smiled a froggy smile, look at that smile, and said, but you'll do. And that was spring again. The end.